Vern Beaver was the Packers' official team photographer for over 60 years. He covered Curly Lambeau, seen here with Don Hudson, and every single significant moment since, like the first game after John F. Kennedy was killed. Now he sits with his two sons, John and Jim, who both followed in their father's footsteps. Jim became the Packers photographer, while John takes pictures for Sports Illustrated. Between the three of them, they have only missed a handful of Packers games since the 1940s. Do you realize how many people would love to trade jobs with you and how, how special it is what you guys are doing? Not available. <laughs> <laughs> During a typical game, they will shoot between 1,000 and 1,200 pictures. I asked each to pick out two all-time favorites. Lombardi and Rizal, where Lombardi was presented the first Super Bowl at that time, World's Championship game trophy. Mm -hmm. uh, it's not an action picture, but the history involved here, we can never pick that picture again. And then, of course, I think I may have to go with maybe the sweep, star handing off to Jim Taylor. What makes the picture Lombardi across the way? John's favorites include a famous picture he took when he was just 16. He was helping his dad at the ice bowl and snapped this picture moments after Bart Starr's sneak. It has since become one of the most well-known photos in NFL history. The sneak uh, has to be my favorite because it has, has the most meaning and it has the history behind it. Uh, my other favorite would be after the first Super Bowl. My dad took me along to the first Super Bowl game uh, in 1966, and this is Vince Lombardi leaving the field um, after the first victory, and this is my dad here on the side um, recording it from a different angle. So. You got, you got both of them in the same picture, and so I'd say that's, that's pretty high up on my list. Who's the most important one there, John? I don't know. <laughs> well, there's two legends in the photo. Yeah. <laughs> Jim's pictures both involve Brett Favre. This is a celebration after the last touchdown of the championship game that we the Packers scored in Green Bay. A similar picture has probably been shot hundreds of times, but uh, this has just the meaning that this was the last one for him in Green Bay. Uh, my other favorite picture was a shot in the uh, locker room. It's pre-game prayer. And um, as you can see, everybody's kneeling except for Brett. And it really, uh, it, to me, it drove home the fact of who the leader of that team was at the time. The three Beavers have been able to record so much NFL and Packers history. What's been an experience that you will never forget? Just being able to basically record history here has, has been a lot of fun.